welcome back to the vlog and welcome back to my channel today i am starting this video i literally just stopped filming a second video that you guys will see soon um but i thought that i would just pick up the camera and vlog anyway since my makeup was already looking cute this was my view a second ago i was just filming for y'all and this is kind of my setup I just basically got ready using all of my current favorites because I haven't really like talked to you guys about like things that I've really been enjoying like the makeup and beauty um, I have done a couple makeup tutorials, but not like one that like I just wanted to share all of my favorites so that you know When you guys see me wearing makeup and vlogs and stuff. This is just a video that you can go to and be like, okay That's what she's using. That's what she's liking, but I'm loving how my skin is looking despite the cluster of breakouts that's trying to peek through I know it's not that noticeable, but today is gonna be a very busy day and kind of a start to a very busy weekend so I thought this would be a good time to vlog because why not make myself even more busy by filming another video today I actually have a friend coming over because actually you guys might remember her her name is Mariam she used to be my assistant slash she would have still been if COVID hadn't happened so maybe you guys will see her in the future but uh, she is gonna come and just kind of pick through some makeup and clothing stuff it'll be nice to see her i literally haven't seen her in like four months or so probably longer than that right now i'm just going to kind of like clean up my space a little bit and eat some breakfast because it's almost 12 pm and i still haven't eaten breakfast i literally have my smoothie over here that i have barely touched you know i do really enjoy eating but when a girl is busy food is pushed to the side unfortunately in my life And I have Mariam here now. Hey guys. Hey, do you guys remember her? It's been so long. It's been too it's long. It's been too long. Literally since we, we had all February. these. I know, literally we had February. all these exciting plans about working together and then. And then quarantine. Yeah, literally crashed and burned. But um, she's here visiting and look what our mom. My, our mom. Our mom. <laughs> look what our mom. <laughs> look what my mom set up for us. So cute. She brought Portos, guys. If someone brings you Portos, they love you. And I love Aisha, so Aww. that tells you something. Thank you, thank you, but thank you, Mama. Good morning and happy weekend, y'all. It is Saturday today, and I don't know if I'm going to be uploading this video today or tomorrow. I meant for another video to go up today, but it's a sponsored video, and unfortunately, the brand <laughs> was being really slow with like approvals and stuff, so... That sucks. It pushes back my schedule. Usually I have like a certain schedule if I have sponsored videos and I put unsponsored videos in between, but it kind of threw off my whole schedule. So I'm kind of annoyed by that, but it comes with the territory. Um, today I actually, I got ready quite early. Um, it's like, I think it actually just turned 12. It's 12.02 right now. And I'm actually speaking on a panel with Glow Recipe. I'm really excited. Um, I mentioned a couple months ago that I'm actually a part of their diversity um, advisory board which is really cool it's like the first time that i've ever been involved on like a board with a brand it's a little bit like outside of you know just social media which, which is really cool it's something that i've always wanted to do and want to continue to do like moving forward so they're hosting like this uh, glow summit which is really cool and i keep saying which is really cool i need to stop that i'm 25 years old <laughs> but i am speaking on it i believe my panel is with three other girls, a moderator, and we're gonna be talking about how we've built up our brands, so that should be fun. I'm trying to figure out where I'm going to speak though because I don't really, I feel like that's not like a great background for, um, for the panel. So I'm thinking I might just move my desk and have like this be my background because this looks a lot nicer but i don't know the lighting's kind of weird so i just thought i'd start filming and um kind of show you guys the mess um or the progress i guess not really the mess i kind of got this like whole 90s look going on right now um you guys will see a tutorial on the makeup look that i had on yesterday so i won't say too much but it is one of the lip oils by iconic london that i've been obsessed with i shared it before but this is a new color in the shade, I think it's Queen Bee. It's really beautiful. And I just paired it with my lip liner, but 
stay tuned for that video so that you guys can see the rest of this face. Um, it's basically the same thing that I did. The panel doesn't start until I think it's like 1.45 or something, so I have some time, but I just want to make sure everything is prepped so that I can do some other work in between that time and not be late, just in case, because sometimes there can be technical difficulties and I don't want that to happen. Hmm, okay, actually, I think I'm just gonna stick it right here because this lighting looks pretty good, let me show y'all. I feel like this could actually work. I mean, one side of my face is a little more brightened, whoops, <laughs> brightened than the other side of my face, but I can see this side's kind of dark, but at the same time, I feel like my makeup looks good. I really like the background. It looks like my little YouTube background, so I feel like this could work. I am gonna change real quick because I'm still in my PJs. Um, I'm wearing this robe from Barefoot Dreams. I, I actually went to their store in Malibu a few weeks ago and they let me pick out some items and I have been obsessed with this robe I've literally been wearing it every day you guys probably notice in the vlogs but it's so soft it's not their like most plush style but I like this more because it's a little bit easier to like move around in it's not like super long um, and I just really like it it keeps me nice and warm and it's so soft this is probably the softest robe that I own slash piece of clothing that I own. So I will link it down below if you guys are interested. I feel like it would make such a good gift for this time of year. Honestly guys, actually I did want to talk about this because I feel like you guys are probably gonna notice. I know most of you guys won't really care because y'all are my riders. Y'all literally support me so much it makes me want to cry. <laughs> but um, with holiday, like for those of you guys who don't know, the last quarter of the year, which is usually like October, November, December, um, is usually like the busiest time for content creators, bloggers and stuff because a lot of brands are actually putting in a lot more money into holiday since they're gonna get more from it, if that makes sense. Like most people spend a lot of their shop or a lot of their uh, money <laughs> around this time of year. So because of that, Alhamdulillah, I get a lot more brand deals, but the thing that I guess, I don't, I don't see it as something that sucks, but I could see how some viewers might feel some type of way. It's just that there's gonna be a lot more sponsored content coming at you guys, so a lot more sponsored videos and stuff, but I'm just saying this and kind of giving you guys a disclaimer right now. All of these are brands that I absolutely love and just like I'm so excited to work with and I just don't want you guys to feel like I'm just throwing a bunch of sponsored content at you for just, you know, just to get a quick check because it's just, I feel like I wanna say 40% of my income comes from these last three months of the year, which says a lot. Um, but yeah, if you guys see, you know, more sponsored content in the future, then um, now you guys know why. And I hope you guys can just support it. And it's always going to be brands that I absolutely love. And I genuinely think that you guys would benefit from and really enjoy seeing. So just keep that in mind. And that is my little tangent. <laughs> but thank you guys for the support always. So this is the outfit I decided on. I'm just wearing some comfy um, joggers on the bottom, but on the top I have this ribbed um, cropped top. And I, you know, figured you're only gonna see me from here, so it should be fine. And then I layered some necklaces from Majuri. Um, pretty much all my jewelry is always from Majuri. But I just got this new ring from, not Majuri actually, let me show you all. It's from, true something true what is it actually called um true curated designs a friend of mine named jill um we actually went on the korea trip with laneige last year together she came out with a collection with them and i am obsessed it's solid gold it's like this stone in the middle and it matches perfectly with this majuri um, necklace that i already had and it's so cute so i'm really into stacking all my rings i think i'm gonna do a video soon just kind of sharing how I style my jewelry with like my everyday outfits anyway so stay tuned for that um, but I'm just getting ready it's like 12 45 so I have about an hour to kill my mom is on the balcony right now because she doesn't want to make any noise she's so cute she's been loving this balcony let's creep on her See if she notices. That's her thinking face. <laughs> it's been her favorite spot. It's the cutest thing. But I'll check in with you guys a little later. 
Zoom panel is complete. My work day is finished and I'm gonna go check up on my mama. I don't know if she's still outside. Maybe she fell asleep. <laughs> she's done that before. Oh yeah, she definitely fell asleep. Oh. Going on a little afternoon stroll with mama. Mm -hmm. We are heading to the dollar store and also Target. We're gonna buy some groceries and just, just get some fresh air. We've been in the house all day. Um, Mama's taking me on her usual walk. Is this the way you usually come? Hmm? Yeah, this the way you come? She, she often walks while I'm doing work mm -hmm. during the day. She just gets some fresh air. So today I'm joining her. Mm -hmm. Somehow ended up at Target and I am currently in the baby aisle because it's the only empty one. Because the weirdest thing is like being caught talking to your camera in the middle of a Target. But anyways, we're just here to get a couple of things. So we'll see if we end up with a couple of things or a cart full. Y'all, we came for one thing, literally, <laughs> just for this. <laughs> and we're leaving with all of this. <laughs> That's what happens when you come to Target. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Let's do a little Target haul. We just got home. I'm gonna do a quick one though, so my life doesn't come out. <laughs> so we got some good old eggs. We got some, I've never tried these before, but I just saw cookie butter and it sounded really good. So we got cookie butter, soft bake cookies, good thins, gluten-free, barbecue, sweet potato crackers. And it also feels like there's like nothing in here. Garlic naan, some good old baby. Yeah, we brought a lot. I know. We literally, guys, we left the house just to get lactose-free milk. Oh my! This, and we came back. <laughs> Got some spinach for our morning smoothies. Um, kettle cooked jalapeno chips, jalapeno. Got some vegetables for Mama's making her famous soup. If you guys want the recipe, I believe I shared um, a recipe on my channel like years ago. But if not, maybe I'll show her making it again today. But we also got some just cut up butternut squash because we couldn't find any pumpkin. We usually like to use pumpkin. Got some celery, zucchini and cucumber as well. Oh, and then I got this. Because I just saw this and it sounded really good. White chocolate mocha from Starbucks used to be like my favorite drink. Thought I'd give the white chocolate mocha a taste since we're already here, in case you guys were curious. Mmm. I like it. It's not too sweet. Usually, if you get the white chocolate mocha from Starbucks, it's like hella sweet. This is like a good, a good sweetness. It kind of just tastes like a... <laughs> it literally just tastes like a regular coffee with milk. I'm like a little sweetener, but I like it. I also want to taste these cookies. Let's give this a try. I kind of want to like dip it. Mmm. Mmm. That is good. My mom always thinks I'm talking to her when I'm vlogging. So she'll like respond to me. This is good. It's um vegan, gluten free. Top eight allergen free, nut free, egg free, wheat free, dairy free, soy free, fish free, shellfish free, mustard free, sesame free, sulfite free. <laughs> it's, so like, what's actually in this if it's free of all? Would recommend that. Hijabi coming at you. Uh, my mom prepped all of the soup ingredients for you guys so you could see it nice and perfectly. So let me show you. We have obviously the chicken, um, red lentils. What is this? Oh, potato, um, squash, carrots, tomatoes. This is a mixture of garlic and ginger that my mom just freezes into these little cubes and puts into all our food. We have celery and cilantro, spinach, um, zucchini, 
And we also use a little bit of chicken broth as well and the rest is just water. And then here she has red onions and green onions. So that's basically it. It's really easy. Right now she's just boiling water and literally all you do is plop all of this in here and let it cook. Um, what spices do you usually use? You can talk. It's spicy? <laughs> yeah. Okay, oregano. Oregano. Mm -hmm. Pepper. Black pepper. Black pepper. Lemon pepper. Of course. You gotta have the lemon pepper, y'all. <laughs> Cumin. Oh, coriander? Coriander. And then salt. Thanks. It's really easy and usually, I'll show you guys a little bit later, but sometimes, you add oatmeal sometimes too, right? Yeah, she just puts a little bit of oatmeal just for some like bite. It makes it a little thicker and just more nutritious. So yeah, super easy vegetable soup. I'll try to um, list out the ingredients down below. Oh, and some extra virgin olive oil as well. And yeah, you just put it in a big pot with some oil. Good healthy amount of oil. Say we cooked it for like an hour. Yeah. It was like an hour, right? How good does that look? Mm. Wow, 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 wow. Thank you, mommy. <laughs> Everything. Yeah. This, you know how many people have re remade this soup? Yeah. So many people are like, oh, I, I remade your mom's soup. Are you gonna do your mom's soup? All of that question. Yeah. People love it. Yeah, it's good. It's so good. But we're gonna enjoy dinner. I think I'm actually gonna end the vlog over here because I don't really have much else to add. I'm gonna enjoy our dinner. And that's pretty much it. So, let me just put this down real quick. If you guys enjoyed this video, then please do give it a thumbs up. And also remember to subscribe to my channel. Um, I'm gonna have a lot of videos coming in the next week because um, as I mentioned those like approval videos the branded videos those are probably all gonna get approved this week so stay tuned you're gonna get a lot of content regardless of whether it's sponsored or not it's gonna be bomb because it's coming from moi <laughs> um, but yeah I love you guys thanks for hanging out with me and I will see you in my next video bye